anyone finds us here, we're sure to lose the trust of the islanders. Esco halen, esco valg me da gengo selerge mantadabem, avenundanum. Mach, es voglen daigan ni dao, a yigi dames et hier come lei. Kairto, Morian, ages radai da radi dao em tairger began. Kauden es greta come lei, nas ol targotu, vregtet et mad advat, abud antadabe me en ekegam, no ada holeg. paintings in the cave were magnificent and have taught us so much. It is obvious that they depict the bonding ritual and its consequences. It is by pouring their blood on the raised stones that the natives become metamorphs. I'm not really sure if I follow you. And yet it's clear to see. The islanders think that their ritual has magic consequences, but there must be some sort of contamination in their blood as they pour it. The only way to verify this theory is to attend a full ritual. We must attend year ones. How will we know when it takes place? Dunkus said it would take place after the young people visited the cave, and they will most likely need some preparation. We should go to the Holy Circle of Kurganau tomorrow. What do you say? Will you come with me? Very well. I hope that Dunkus will not be too angry after seeing us there. Let's take some time to rest, and then we'll go back to the place where we met them.
You again? Your curiosity is truly unquenchable. Forgive our intrusion, Dunkus. But I really want to attend Yewan's ritual. I have learned a lot thanks to you, but I still have so much left to understand. If you were one of ours, Afra, I would be flattered to have such an inquisitive and resolute apprentice. You can attend the ritual, but promise me that you will be discreet. No Renaixe ever had this honor before. We will do everything in our power to prove ourselves worthy of your trust, Dunkus. How are you? You must be feeling impatient. Impatient, yes, and a little bit afraid as well. It's only natural to be afraid, Yerwan. It's a new life starting for you, but I will be by your side. Now and forever. You look preoccupied. Our people have suffered many lion's attacks, often during rituals. In some villages, all the young Sinal Manawi were abducted. You seem different from the other Zafra. But I can't help worrying. I have nothing to do with these attacks, Dunkus, I swear. I believe you. Otherwise, you would not be here with us. But I hope that your brothers will not be there, in the shadows, ready to pounce on our children. Times really must have changed for some Renaixe to attend our rituals. These are very different from the others. Their leader is an Onol Menawi, after all. I know I look like them, but I'm not one of them. You may not be bonded, but your parents must have been. You should be proud and happy about it. It is probably thanks to your bond that Dunkas has accepted your presence. Nestiri, Adesta Marar Mam. Meneda, Meneda, You are an Onol Manawi now, Yawan. And soon you will heal the earth by our sides. Like a real Donigad. Thank you, Donkas. I feel so proud. I am so happy that we can be Voglindaiga together at last. What about you, Afra? Did you find the answers you were looking for? It's strange. I didn't exactly understand what happened. But I am moved. Some events must be understood with the heart, not the head. It seems like you are right, Tunkus. We are under attack. Grab the enemy from off. The others don't matter. No. They won't attack you. Decide that you have to protect them. You can count on me. Get out of here! 
Curiosity Afra has saved lives. If it weren't for you, people from my village would have been abducted or killed. I am infinitely grateful, especially considering that fighting against your brothers could not have been easy. Indeed. These people were brutes. They had it coming. However, you don't know how right you are, Dunkus. I recognize some of these men. Really? Did they belong to the governor's court? No. They worked for my former master, Dr. Asili. I was his student for a long time before I realized that this man's methods were... questionable. He was so obsessed with his goals that he became cruel. But I can't believe he'd go as far as abducting people for his experiments. You think that the Onol Manawi are used for experiments? Now that I have seen these soldiers, I am certain of it, and I am afraid they may suffer atrocious treatment under the guise of scientific progress. I am so ashamed. Come now, shame serves no purpose. And you are proof that the Loyans are not all the same. Thank you, Dunkus. And thank you, Desade. You opened my eyes. Steward. Hello, my name is Desarde. I'm the legate of the merchant congregation. May I enter? Good day, legate Desarde. No, this building is closed to Renaixe. I am Siora, daughter of Vladne, daughter of Meb. My mother, the Mal of the Red Spears, was a member of the council. All here remember, and the Vorst Tirse. She was a courageous Mal. But you are not yet Mal in her stead, and you do not carry her seal. I am sorry, Siora. I cannot allow you to enter. I beg your pardon. I did not know. If I cannot enter, perhaps you could tell the Elder of the Council that I request an audience. Glendon cannot speak with you, Legate. Times are difficult, and his time is precious. 
He only accepts to meet the members of the council or their representatives. How can I prove that I'm the representative of one of them? If you are a trusted friend of a council member, he will give you his seal, and we would know it. I will then be glad to allow you to enter. You would be the first Renaixe to obtain such an honor. I will return later. If you have a seal, you will be welcome. If not, you are wasting your time and mine. Hey, dear sir, happy to see you again in such fine health. How can I be of service? What do you know about the ruins found to the northwest of here? <laughs> the site that the natives call Didakidnadagais. I had countless questions about the place when our explorers and scouts first brought back sketches. Intrigued, I went there. I noted the architecture and their decorations. It is certain that they bear a striking resemblance with continental constructions, but they are more ancient. Too old to have been recently built by the Bridge Alliance settlers when they first set foot on the island. I even questioned the natives, but they only spoke of a people of the sea. My first thoughts went to the Norts, but they're not known for building large towns, less so cities. There are other ruins on a cliff to the east of here, Perhaps they hide the key to this mystery. I hoped to organize an expedition, but the region is dangerous and hard of access. We explored mines at the bottom of the cliff, but we were not able to find an access to the plateau. If the mystery of these ruins intrigues you as much as me, it is in that direction that you should begin to look for answers. Can I help you with any other matter? My lady, I have to go. Goodbye. We should find the ruins mentioned by Lady Morange in this area.
Up there, the ruins Lady Mirage told us about. But I don't see a path. Some of the tunnels in the mine may lead to it. We should go there.
Unusual customers. <laughs> well, greetings, my lord. How? It's a pleasure. Here's the entrance to the mine. It may be worth all... Good grief. Please, sir. Good day. What can I do for you? What can you tell me about the ruins on the plateau? You aren't the first to ask me about them, but the answer is still the same. I've nothing to tell you. Not that I wouldn't want to, but I've never been there. There must have been a path once upon a time, but it's no longer there. Maybe it collapsed. Some say that you have to pass through the mines to get there. A few of the tunnels do climb. It's certainly possible, I would say. But those tunnels are all closed, and we have better things to do. The iron ore. It doesn't come out of the ground by itself. Do you need anything else? 
talk to me about the mines. It wasn't us that first dug them out. They're really old. Centuries old. But those tunnels are full of riches. It takes little effort to unearth the minerals that we want. What more could we ask for? Seeing as how there aren't that many of us, if we were pressed to mine all the tunnels, we'd be too few. But the time will come when folks hear about what we're pulling from these rocks. We won't be alone for much longer. Good day. What? I'm headed out. Goodbye. Good. Did you build this village? Not by myself, no. We did it. We have to sleep somewhere, you know. We don't have much here, and we'd sure like the place to prosper and grow. Maybe more miners will come. Then we'd start to attract all manner of merchants and craftsmen. Do you need anything else? I'm headed. Goodbye. Excellency, it is an honor. Hello. You lost? No. Why do you ask? It's just that we rarely get visitors. Well then, what can I do for you? What can you tell me about the ruins that we can see up there? Uh, not a great deal. To my knowledge, no one's ever been able to reach them. There were some officials from the city that came, but when they saw they couldn't easily climb up to the plateau, they just left. There must have been a path that caved in. Unless some sort of tunnel in the mine takes you there. Anything else? What can you tell me about the mine? It's ancient work. The natives must have dug it out a long time ago and then abandoned it. Even if it is strange work for islanders, it looks more like something we would do on a continent. We're trying to restore it. The rock is extremely rich in iron ore. But the tunnels are very old. You need to go slowly. None of us are in a humor to be buried alive. We did explore a few of them, and we're exploiting the closest, but others, nah, they're still inaccessible. Anything else? I'll leave you to it then. Until we meet again.
Finally, here we are. These are the ruins that Lady Lorraine spoke to us about. And she was right. These do not resemble native constructions at all. Explore the area. Something may give away the identity of the architects. To my house! <laughs>
This journal confirms what we suspected. A continental nation had once attempted to colonize the island with the help of the Nords, and they were repulsed. From what I was able to decipher, few of them actually managed to escape. Hmm. The major part of the journal has faded, and I'm not able to decipher the name of the author. Let's continue our search. We must discover which nation was here. This seal, I know the insignia, even if it has become more detailed in recent decades. It's hard to believe my eyes. What you're seeing doesn't seem to please you. This is the ancient coat of arms of Serene. It's a congregation seal. I think the information is pointing to something clear. No possible doubt remains. All the clues point in the same direction. The people from the sea who built these ruins and confronted the natives they were us. Goes to show that times change. To think that you were once conquerors. You're gonna have to pay me more for protection. If it comes out, there will be those who see red. Oh, this must be the reason they kept us in the dark. A Constantine is gonna be furious when he learns this.
cousin! You have returned! How did things go? Oh, you don't look well. What's happened here? Nothing. Nothing terribly bad in any case. I must have eaten something that's having trouble going through me. Seems to me that this illness has been lingering too long. Who prepares your meals? Are they safe? No one is poisoning me, dear cousin. We are far from court and their customs. It's nothing. Take my word for it. Now then, what do you have to tell me? We had a talk with Lady Morange and we explored the ruins that she suggested we visit. All our findings point to one conclusion. Those ruins were originally built by the Congregation of Merchants. The Congregation? Us? But Father never once even hinted. Once again, he must have deemed me unworthy to know the secret. How he must despise me. A Constantine. We need to learn more. I want to understand. I need to know everything my father has kept from me. This question also concerns you. You look too much like a native for that to be a coincidence. Since we cannot bombard my father with questions, others here must give us the answers we require. The congregation, even in the past, could not have made it to this island without help. We are pitiful sailors. You are thinking of us. But I assure you that I know nothing of this story. You are perhaps simply not aware, but your admiral stationed at the captainry surely is. Go and find her, cousin. Try to learn the final chapter of this story. Very well. Anything else? I'm going to leave now. Goodbye, Constantine. Look out for yourself. Karantz, do you need something? I must... 